In the afternoon, Ib and her parents were going to an art gallery about an artist named Gutena Weiss. There were lots of paintings and sculptures. Among them was a very big painting. Suddenly, all the gallery went black and everyone had disappeared. Ib was guided to a painting of the deep sea and she suddenly fell into it and everything went black again. Ib found herself in a world where art came to life and there was a red rose that would hurt her if the petals were to fall. Ib had to keep it safe and escape. After some time, she met Gary. He had a blue rose, and he was older than her. They decided that they would escape together. Then they bumped into a young and energetic girl. Her name was Mary, and she had a yellow rose. She wanted to escape too. At one point, they got separated. Mary had found a palette knife, and Gary found a book titled The Collective Words of Gutena. He couldn't believe what he was seeing. Mary wasn't a real person, but a painting. He went to go tell Ib, and they ran away from her. After some exploring, they were facing Mary's original canvas. She was very angry. She wanted to become real. And for that, she had to take the place of one of them. But then Gary destroyed the painting, making Mary disappear forever. Way to the original gallery. Their passage back to the real world had opened. Gary jumped into the painting, but Ib didn't. She saw her mom. However, it was a fake one trying to keep her in this world. Ib took Gary's hand. Then everything went white. Ib was back in the real gallery, but she couldn't remember anything. Then she saw a man that had her handkerchief. They both wondered why, but then... Ib, how could I have forgotten? We were stuck together for that bizarre gallery. Can I keep this handkerchief a while longer? I'll have to clean it, and then I'll give it back. <laughs> With that, they parted ways, promising they would reunite once more.